Muslim teen killed in violent assault by Hindu extremists. On July 21st, an 18-year-old teenager known as B, or first name, first initial B, Masood, was assaulted and killed in the Indian state of Karnataka by members of right-wing Hindu gangs. At least eight men associated with the Vishwa Hindu Parishad, or VHP, and the Bajrang Dal were behind this incident. All of them have been arrested. According to Masood's friend, Sharif, the discontent started when the victim bought a three-month-old baby cow. The police were alerted, and they had inquired into the matter to ascertain if Basud had any intentions of slaughtering the calf. On July 18th, I'm sorry, July 19th, a neighbor named Sudhir, a Hindu foot follower, uh, what in, and Masood had a physical altercation regarding the calf. Sudhir reportedly lured Masood into a secluded spot in the village where Sudhir, together with seven others, attacked him. Masood was eventually found by a well in critical condition and brought to the hospital, where he succumbed to his injuries two days later. So this, when I first started researching the story, I thought it was just one murder. But there are actually, really, this is about th three different murders that happened in Karnataka in one week. So this, so what I just read to you is like the starting point, right? And now I'm going to, that's what first happened. And now I want to unpack what happened afterwards. So this Muslim teenager Masood was like beaten to death. Okay. And then a few days later, there was a BJP youth leader in the area whose first name was Praveen. And Praveen was closing up his shop one day when out of nowhere, someone comes and slashes his head with a machete and Praveen, this BJP youth leader, he dies and people are outraged. There's protests. And then what happens is this chief minister of the state, for those who don't know, the chief minister is basically like the governor, the governor of the state actually goes to the home of the family of Praveen to personally express his condolences and talk about how they're gonna have a probe into the incident and all this stuff, and also promise Praveen's family compensation because he's no longer there to provide for the family, right? A few days after the, the governor goes to visit Praveen's family, a, a third man named Faisal, Muslim man, is hacked in the street. And so, what people, some allegations that are going around is that, so first Masood was murdered. And then some people say that this BJP youth leader, Praveen, was murdered in retaliation for Masood's death. So far, a motive for Praveen's murder has not really been established. And then after Praveen died, Many people are saying that the murder of Faisal, the third man, was in retaliation for the uh, retaliation for the death of Praveen. So it's like a tit for tat. That's what some people are alleging. You know, that these are some of the rumors about this. And what's interesting, though, is that one, like I said, people have pointed it out that there has been preferential treatment for the government because there there's been called for the NIA itself to to probe into Praveen's death this the governor went to go visit Praveen's family and promised them compensation but there has been none offered to the families of Masood or Faisal oh my god why do you have to distract me with this right now <laughs> You can't make this up. Someone literally named Shiva is asking, is the baby cow safe? Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh my is God. he? Is she? Sorry. Is he or she? Did I don't they know. Say, I mean, there's I so know. many people dying. Uh, we want to make sure that... Is the baby safe. cow safe? I can't deal with this. I can't deal with Was this. Was it all for naught, or did they manage to save the baby oh cow? Oh, my God. You're just being catphobic for not caring about the yeah. cow. Yeah. So what is happening and what is extremely telling to me is 
this is extremely telling. Before, so there for you know back and forth, back and forth these murders, right? For the third murder of Faisal, before he was even declared dead, before he was even declared dead, local BJP groups were circulating rumors that his death was because he was a low caste Shia who married an upper caste Sunni girl. So this was Shia Sunni conflict, and this rumor that was started by BJP group before he was even declared dead actually began circulating in large newspapers that are supposed to be credible for areas of South India like the Deacon Herald repeating this completely untrue just made up thing there isn't actually like a Shia community even in this area he was he wasn't a Shia he was buried according to Sunni rights funeral rights and so it's just so telling to me that why were they circulating this, that he was dead and that it was because of Sunnis and Shias before he was even dead. Wait, like really? that seems like, like there's a distraction happening, like a red herring. They were planning it like a, this way. By the way, there are multiple um, requests for arresting the baby cow in the live chat. Just oh, we should arrest the baby cow. <laughs> Wait, this is hilarious. <laughs> like, Bengali Hindu, arrest the baby cow. <laughs> I hear another one here. Yeah. Arrest the cow. So not Sen is saying, arrest the cow. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> you guys have a point. I mean, was the cow was the cow is too young to be held responsible? Uh, yeah, we can't Maybe prosecute the cow as an adult. Um <laughs> Kate. <laughs> Kate is saying, LOL, don't pay attention to rare criminal activities. Uh, it is common in every country. Even criminal activities are very high in U.S. because of gun shootings. What does okay, this have well, to okay. do with anything? Yeah, like we will. Yeah, if the gun shootings were about religious, um, we would cover that as well. Like obviously, this is atheist republic. Okay, so we're we're not gonna like oh ignore this crime because crime happens other places as well. What? Well, yeah, and we would cover them if it was about religion. Okay, I don't understand. Like, this is like such a don't like su such a pathetic attempt at what about is Like, oh yeah, c crimes happen in other places, so <laughs> this doesn't matter. Hey, newsflash, Armin and Susanna, crimes happen. Okay, <laughs> crimes happen. Why are you reporting this? The crime is a thing. Did you not? Did, is it just is it a revelation to you that crimes happen in places? Like, this is such a desperate attempt to save India. Like. You know, like you know, you're not like you want to ignore the fact that this is happening because U.S. also has crimes. Like, how, what, at what lengths are you going to go through to whitewash everything that is happening in India? Like other places have. Well, why are you talking about India? Like, you know that North Korea is worse than that's why you're talking about the U.S. Like, like North Korea is worse than the U.S. So why are you like you have no business talking about crimes? happening in north korea uh, in us when we have north korea like do you just want to go to the lowest to the worst case scenario as a way to do you, we, we should all stop talking about anything as long as there's something worse happening somewhere else it makes no sense okay let's read some other comments forever stormy is saying i'm surprised this doesn't happen more often oh wait no this is for the last story oh yeah sorry um oh no yeah i forgot to mention doorknob head just gave us 20 dollars oh my god thank you doorknob head thank you doorknob head and people were like saying thank you M music guy was saying thank you d was saying thank you uh, so thank you doorknob head. Yeah. thank you we have the best community i love when yeah. everyone like thanks everyone else for how they contribute i think that's special. yeah that's very sweet <laughs> um, um forever stormy is saying we need a flow chart for this news susanna <laughs> okay yeah this was <laughs> we got here to here to here yeah i, was, I, I, was know, I thought it was really because i i've been seeing people have been sending me that oh this bjp youth leader had been killed blah 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 but you know, people are reporting that a motive isn't known yet. So I didn't want to cover it on the news yet. And then when I was researching this story, I realized that it was all connected. Potentially, there's a connection, I should say. Oh, Samantha is saying, <laughs> love you guys. Well, that's so sweet. Oh, thank you. You should, we should make, we should have, you know how that meme with the guy with the conspiracy theory, like drawing on a whiteboard, okay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We should put your face on it and then have a baby cat. <laughs> 
have a baby cow in the middle of the whiteboard where everything turns like connected to the baby cow. Like <laughs> somebody make that mean. Wait, actually, actually that's so good. No, it has to be me furiously tracking like Hindutva nonsense. But instead of the the strings on the wall being, you know, like the red strings to connect wait. everything together, they have to be like saffron colored. Yeah, wait, wait, let me show people what I'm talking about for people who don't know. Wait. From it's yeah, from this... Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then we could have like a baby like a picture of a baby cow right here. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh god <laughs> well people died we shouldn't be laughing why are we laughing people were killed <laughs> that's not funny oh this, this, is, this, is, this is how we show okay <laughs> <laughs> i was just trying to make it emotionally torture you because you're, like, you're having fun and then i ruined it <laughs> Yeah, I know. You do that on purpose all the time. <laughs> I know, I know. I like to traumatize Susan. She's like... <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. Well, guys, okay, let me let me, let me me fix it for you, okay? I know you're feeling oh. guilty right now, okay? Okay? <laughs> the world is very dark, okay? And mm -hmm. if we can't find a way to make this consumable, okay, then people wouldn't be aware of this, okay? Because people are already stressed out, okay? And if we just give them bad news... They will just tune out and they wouldn't consume the information that they need to know aware of, right? So we need to add a little bit of like sweet, you know. Levity. Yeah. Levity. Just so to, just like the people can actually. Well, and here's the difference. Care. We're not laughing at these people who were killed. Yeah. We're laughing at their murder or at their expense. We're talking about the story and then other things about the way that we yes, talk about yes. the broader themes. We're not like, ha -ha, people died. <laughs> like, we're no. not doing that. <laughs> yeah okay. like the absurdity of other aspects to the situation you know yeah anyways yes, yes. it's called yeah it's called dark humor dark humor works mm -hmm. and atheist republic needs your help we've been the target of many legal attacks by hindu nationalists ever since our founder armin Abhabi blasphemed against hindu deities we have retained legal counsel to help us defend our access to our community in india we have started a fundraiser that will help us afford to tackle many legal issues, including judicial harassment and censorship. Whatever you can contribute will go a long ways in helping us in this fight. Link in the description below.